another day another story chapter 3 of punishments section 53 punishments the punishments to which offenders are liable under the provisions of this code are first death two secondly imprisonment for life three fourthly imprisonment which is of two descriptions namely one rigorous that is with hard labor two simple fifthly forfeiture of property sixthly fine section point five three a construction of reference to transportation one subject to the provisions of subsection two and subsection three any reference to transportation for life in any other law for the time being in force or in any instrument or order having effect by virtue of any such law or of any enactment repeal shall be construed as a reference to imprisonment for life. 2. In every case in which a sentence of transportation for a term has been passed before the commencement of the Code of Criminal Procedure, Amendment, Act, 5, 1955, 26 of 1955, the offender shall be dealt with in the same manner as if sentenced to rigorous imprisonment for the same term. 3. Any reference to transportation for a term or to transportation for any shorter term, by whatever name called, in any other law for the time being in force shall be deemed to have been omitted. 4. Any reference to transportation in any other law for the time being in force shall, a, if the expression means transportation for life, be construed as a reference to imprisonment for life, b, if the expression means transportation for any shorter term, be deemed to have been omitted. Section. 54. Commutation of sentence of death, in every case in which sentence of death shall have been passed, 6. The appropriate government, may, without the consent of the offender, commute the punishment punishment for any other punishment provided by this code. Section 55. Commutation of sentence of imprisonment for life, in every case in which sentence of 7, imprisonment, for life shall have been passed, 8. The appropriate government, may, without the consent consent of the offender, commute the punishment for imprisonment of either description for a term not exceeding 14 years. 1. 55a. Definition of, appropriate government, in sections 54 and 55 the expression, appropriate government, means, a, uh, in cases where the sentence is a sentence of death or is for an offense against any law relating to a matter to which the executive power of the union extends, the central government, and, b, in cases where the sentence, whether of death or not, is for an offense against any law relating to a matter to which the executive power of the state extends, the government of the state within which the offender is sentenced. Section 56. Sentence of Europeans and Americans to Penal Servitude. Proviso as to sentence for term exceeding 10 years but not for life. Representative by the Criminal Law, Removal of Racial Discriminations, Act, 1949, 17 of 1949, W. A. F., the 6th of April 1949. Section 57. Fractions of Terms of Punishment. In calculating fractions of terms of punishment, 2. Imprisonment, for life shall be reckoned as equivalent to 2. Imprisonment, for 20 years. Section 58. Offenders sentenced to transportation how dealt with until transported. Representative by the Code of Criminal Procedure, Amendment, Act, 1955, 26 of 1955, S. 117 and the SCH. W. A. F. The 1st of January 1956. Section 59. Transportation instead of imprisonment. Representative by S.117 and the SCH. Ibad. W. A. F. The 1st of January 1956. Section 60. Sentence may be, in certain cases of imprisonment, wholly or partly rigorous or simple, in every case in which an offender is punishable with imprisonment which may be of either description, it shall be competent to the court which sentences such offender to direct in the sentence that such imprisonment shall be wholly rigorous, or that such imprisonment shall be wholly simple, or that any part of such imprisonment shall be rigorous and the rest simple. Section 61. Sentence of Forfeiture of Property. Representative by the Indian Penal Code, Amendment, Act, 1921, 16 of 1921, S. 4. Section 62. Forfeiture of property, in respect of offenders punishable with death, transportation or imprisonment. Representative by S. 4. Ibad. Section 63. 
amount of fine, where no sum is expressed to which a fine may extend, the amount of fine to which the offender is liable is unlimited, but shall not be excessive.